Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Millie and I'm very excited to decorate for Halloween today. It's going to be a few touches around the house and old classic style with some vintage finds that I hope you like. For some reason my microphone stopped working. I apologize for that. But I was just telling you that I went to Magnolia to the silos because they were filming the silos baking competition. Joanna was there of course and I just filmed a little bit so I thought you wouldn't mind showing you a tiny bit of that if you want to see it it would be later on in the video okay so now let's start decorating to decorate this table first I'm using this garland that I got last year I think it's from Target to give a little background there and then on top of the table I'm using this black fabric like mesh material to give that creepy effect. I chose it in black because I think it contrasts with the color of the table. And I like how it looks. I think it goes well together. On top I'm putting this book by Edgar Allan Poe, one of my favorite authors, especially this time of the year. I love the cover and then on top I put this skull from Michaels and this amber glass vase from Hobby Lobby and the bottle is from Target Dollar Spot from last year and then I have this beautiful frame that I got at Goodwill I think it has the perfect old vintage vibe that I was looking for and the print is from the craft gallery if you remember I show it on my last video and this candle holder is from Goodwill, another thrift find. I like that it has the same all antique vibe as the frame. They go perfect together. This trick or treat sign is from Michaels. I decided to put it in the middle between the two bottles. I think it looks great there as the main focus of the table. And then below I grab this crate that is from Michaels from a few years ago and I flip it to give it more height. On top I'm putting these books. This one is from Goodwill too and this is a box from Dollar Tree that I got last year. I like the colors and this pumpkin from Kirkland's and this pillow is one of my favorite items of the whole video it's from Michaels too I love the print perfect for the style of decor I'm looking for and this is the final result For my coffee table, I'm keeping it very simple with this gas material in this creamy color that I think it goes well with the color of the table. I'm using the same copper tray from Heart and Hand that I use for my fall decor and this beautiful cat candle from Marshalls from last year. I think it's so cute. I'm putting it inside this dome from Hobby Lobby and to give it height and I'm using this candle holder from Dollar Tree in black and this pumpkin on top this is from Walmart and with a tea light candle inside and these cute tiny bottles are from Target from the Dollar Spot from last year
it was nighttime already and I thought it was perfect for the video. And here I'm putting this mesh material that I got at the Dollar Tree with this beautiful sign from Kirklands. I love it, it has this Victorian old vibe. I love it, I think it looks good there. And from my table I was looking for a black placemat or charger to put in the middle, but I found this beautiful table runner at Paris City. I thought it was so cute, I love how it looks. And here I'm keeping it very simple too with this double that I use in my fall decor too, with this small wreath that I love, I love these colors. I think they look precious together. This is from Target the Dollar Spot from this year. I love it. And I'm putting in the middle this pumpkin, this plastic pumpkin that I think is from Dollar Tree. I think it looks very pretty together with these candle holders that I got at Goodwill. And this is how it ended up. Let me know in the comments if you like to decorate for Halloween, what style you like, if you like this old vintage style or more modern, please let me know in the comments. So now let's go to the silos. As I said in the beginning, I went to the silos to see the silos baking competition. They are filming for the past two weeks. They've been filming every other day. On Monday is going to be the final episode. Joanna is there every time. And as you can see, they are having a great time. Everything looks so pretty. So I just film a little to show it to you. And if you're familiar with my channel, you know that I have to go to my favorite spot at the silos, these beautiful gardens. Let me know what is your favorite spot from the silos, from Magnolia Market. Leave me a comment down below. And the Silovration event is coming very soon here at the Silos and of course I'm going to film everything and show it to you so if you want to see it don't forget to subscribe and click in the red bell notification so you can get notified every time I upload a new video so you won't miss it. So I hope you like this video, don't forget to give me a thumbs up, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one, bye!